G'day folks, I'm Donald Webster and right here is my Alpine Renault A110 Barrelly Net. Now it's Alpine, not Alpine, as the number plate will suggest, because it's French. So they don't say Alpine, they say Alpine. So forever and a day they have been Alpines. In 1960s, a chap called Jean Radelet, who was a Frenchman who lived in a little town called Dieppe in the, uh, on the uh, English coast, he uh, designed a little fiberglass body to fit on a Renault 4CV. Not many of you will see those cars around, there are not very many of them around today. Anyway, he uh, souped up the engine, he had a chap called Gordini do the mods on the engine and he put it in this little tiny car and off they went and they were just world beaters in their time, I'm talking mid 60s here. Then uh, he wanted a bigger car and the Renault brought out the R8, quite an iconic little square boxy car. Anyway, the R8s were um, quite um, ahead of their time, rear engine of course, as most cars were in those days. And um, he designed this new shape with the help of some other designers, but effectively what we see in front of us is called the A110. So the A110 started life as 1100 and morphed into a 1600S, which was the base for this car. I got the car out here in 2005, it's a 1971. It was, uh, came out of the factory at the end of January 71 and it arrived with these big um, bubble flares on it which are called Group 5 flares and when it arrived in New Zealand in 2004 it was a mess. So we had to set about getting it ready for motorsport. I had Mark Herbert of uh, Herbert Fabrications do all the safety gear. Uh, we had Lance Bell of Arrow Wheels um, make up some amazing uh, copies of a French um, wheel but we had to have them in 15 inch because you can't get good 13 inch tyres. We've um, now um, put an 1800cc engine in the car based on a Renault 16. At the time in 1973, the Alpine won the very first World Rally Championship. They won six of the nine um, uh, races that year, the rallies that year, and they went on to win the World Rally Championship for the first time in 1973.